Dadia Panta la Balababa. I cut a la Baradia Dolo Kadabababa Shadia Kantaya da Bahaya. I Panta la Baradia Karadia Teleba Kadadia Teleba Kurala. I Panu Adadia da Kataya. I Taladia Paradia Teleba Dadia Teleba Karadadi and Teleba Dadia Dosha. I Paladeleba Kantolo Bodo Badadia Kodabakaya. I am Telebara, Telebacadia, Telebacuda Badaya, A Paladia, Telebacadia, Doloba Sanda, A Maladia, Palado, A Tandelebaba, A Telebacadia, Dolobo Sadia, Kadababa. We give you praise, we give you glory, we give you praise, we give you glory, we exalt your holy name, our God, our Master, our Healer. Our soon coming King, we exalt you, Lord. We give you praise. We give you praise. We give you praise. We give you praise, beloved. Wherever you are, wherever you are listening to us, hearing the sound of our voice, we have come to give God praise and thanks. We want you to join us as we give God. A resounding praise, a resounding thanksgiving for his mercy, for his goodness, for his power, for his preservation over your life, over your destiny, over your children, over your family, even over your business, whatever concerns you. I want you to begin for the next few minutes. Just lift your voice in other tongues. For the next 15 seconds, you want to begin to charge yourself in the spirit. Radia Baradi. Ya koda dia danda, akada dia teleba kada dia dolo bosanda, aradele ba kada dia teleba kada dia teleba dua, iman tulu ada dia kan teleba kosa, aman teleba kada dia palu ada dia dia, iya teleba kada dia dosanda kapa, imeleli ya dosanda kata ya, iya nada balala dia tua kada dia pali ya don teleba tan dolo bosanda, aden teleba kan teleba kuda bata dia dia, imele kada dia Pala dua tadi ya berdi ya kuda baya, iya lebe kara dia polo bade ya pandele ba koya, indele ba kuda bala ba posa dia kapaya, iya ndele ba kandele ba tadi ya pola, arota dia sele ba ba posa, akandele ba do ba do ba posa kaya, iya lebe lebe be sando ba posa, imendele ba kuda ba ba posa kaya, arandele ba kuda ba 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 posa kaya, indele ba 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 posa le ya tola kaya, indele ba ba In this fed series, you want to begin to invite somebody. Come on, for the next one minute, I want you to intentionally begin to share this page. Let somebody begin to hear about the word of God that is about to come with power, with zest, with favor, with strength. In the name of Jesus, I want you to call somebody. Call somebody. Dial somebody's number. Send the link on WhatsApp. Send the link. Share it on Facebook. Share it on Twitter. Share it on all the social media platforms. Let somebody begin to hear the word of the Lord. You want to intentionally call someone. Listen, for the next few seconds, I want you to become an agent of evangelism. Become. Let your spirit man begin to catch somebody. Maybe someone has shared an issue with you and the person is down and broken heart and share the link to the person. There is somebody you know in the hospital that is in need of healing. I need you to share the link with the person share the link let somebody hear about the fire of God that is about to be released today in the name of Jesus Christ the healing power of God is about to be released the delivering power 
power of God is about to break forth. The saving power of God is about to be released to somebody's home. Somebody's marriage is breaking apart. You want to share the link and let the hand of God be extended, become an extension of God's grace today. In the name of Jesus, share it, share it, share it. Continue to share it and make sure you at least if you don't share, share to about 10 people. Share to about 10 people. Make sure you share it. You are in the office. There is somebody that is broken down. There is somebody that has received a dismissal letter. But you want to share the link to encourage the person. You are around some people who don't have even what to take for the next level. They are broken down but you want to share the link. You may not have money to give them but you can give them this link. And the hand of God will surely touch them. Beloved, I want you to for the next few minutes lift your voice and begin to bless the name of our God. Lift your voice, begin to bless the name of our God. Begin to consider the work of his hands. David said, what is man that thou art mindful of him and the son of man that thou visited. Lift your voice somebody and begin to bless the name of our God. Our father, our God, our master. We come before you with our heart full of thanksgiving and we bless your name Maru Karade le Baroka Mantan Tolo Boko Sande Arade le Boko Dua Da Bamba Alasha Da Baka Da Babaya Ale Parada Baku Da Bakande Anda La Bada Bate le Boko Sando Imala Kada Bala Baba Sande Kaba Arade le Amala Dia Kosa Ya Alasi Ya Tele Baka Da Babaya Elaka Nele Bada Dia Bala Dua Kada Ya Elaka Da Bada Dia Bala Dia Pena Alasha Nele Baku Da Daya in Let your name be lifted. Let your name be glorified. I am that I am. We bless your name. El Shaddai, we give you glory. El Gabor, may your name be exalted. Oh Lord, our God, how excellent is your name in all the earth. The heavens are telling your glory. The skies are proclaiming the works of your hands. The nations are healed at the sound of your voice. Alpha and Omega, your praise we declare. Randele Bokoshaya, Ella Kudabakaya, Ella Kadabosha, no Kabaya, Ella Kadabana Babosakaya, Ella Kadababa Shanda, Ella Kadababa Shanda Bakaya, Indele Bakadababa Shanda Baka, Akadabana Matele Baka, Ella Madabo Shanda Kadakaya, in the name. Of Jesus, we want to pray one more prayer. We want to declare that let the hand of God come over today's broadcast. Let the spirit of God hover upon today's broadcast. The Bible said, and when he came, he said, you shall receive power after that the Holy Ghost has come upon you. And certainly they received power. Power. They received unusual grace to do the impossible. We want to declare in the name of Jesus, let the hand of the Lord, let the spirit of Jehovah rest mightily upon today's service. Let it be extraordinary. Let somebody receive a tangible manifestation of the power, the grace, the, gra the, the oil of God upon their lives in the name of Jesus. Let nobody receive today this word and God the same anybody that will open the link let them receive the fire of God in the name of Jesus Christ can you begin to lift your voice say my father my father, my father say my father. right now I declare, I declare over my ears over my, ears, over my, eyes, over my eyes when I receive, when I receive the, word the word of the Lord let my life, let my life begin, to begin to change let my family, let my family begin Begin to change. Let my business begin to change. Let my career begin to change. Let my academics begin to change. I receive that change from above. In the name of Jesus, any chain around my life as the word comes, let it break off. Let it break off. Somebody shall break off. Break off, 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 break
Hallelujah. It, I want you to just open your mouth and give God the glory. The word just lift your voice and say something to Jesus. Yes, Jesus Christ of me, Dobu. Yes, Yes, you 
Sohi, yeah, he Jesus on a river. Every yeah, 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 river.
for you and the providence that we are God bless you for such a time like this God bless you I want you to watch out for her she has a single that she's about to release I know it is going to be awesome providence God bless you for such an awesome ministration God bless you beloved wherever that you are I want you to share the page if you have not shared it I want you to share it. Let somebody be a beneficiary of what God is doing here right now. In the name of Jesus Christ, the Westminster Catechism says the whole essence of man is to glorify God and enjoy Him all the days of his life. That is the whole duty of man. We are supposed to just lift up the name of God and just bless the name of God. Beloved, wherever that you are, I want you to just share the page right now. All protocols observe the Reverend Stephen of Bayamwako is around, but he just gave us the opportunity to be a blessing to God's people. This is an awesome time. It's a time that we come and experience the power or the natural is about to go down for the supernatural to take over beloved i want you to invite somebody i want to give you the next 20 seconds share the page right now share the page share the page let somebody be a blessing in the name of jesus all protocols observe our presiding bishop papa god bless you and mama wherever that you are god bless you we salute our 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 able administrative bishop uh, the right reverend michael bosman everybody god bless you we salute the thermodiocese bishop papa god bless you the right reverend samuel ofori achia papa god bless you and our our late chairman papa wherever you are brother Alfred Sechi, you and mama god bless you for the good work that you are doing for your unflinching support your passion for the things of God I know that your life will be blessed everybody our our Tema circuit uh, uh, our superintendent minister and uh, the, the doctor SO in Japan Papa God bless you wherever that you are you and mama for the good work for your support and every minister in here represented we say God bless you for the good work that you are doing in the Methodist church Ghana, and every man of God that is watching us God bless you and may God empower you more for ministry in the name of Jesus Christ we salute our father we salute the Reverend Stephen Obiam who is around and so uh, and so Papa we salute you for the good work for this support for this platform that has uh, unleashed the giftings that people have we say that God bless you for the good work that you are doing and may God so almighty blessings and may in this month of March may you march into your blessings in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen and amen. 
Beloved, we, we started uh, something that we have been dealing with. When he comes. When he comes. And we are talking about no other than the Holy Ghost. We are talking about the Holy Spirit. When the Holy Spirit comes. And so from the very first day, uh, we have tried to just uh, do pull one or two strings to explain about the Holy Spirit and his doings. And I remember the last time that we met, we Papa talked about the fact that when the Spirit of God comes, he picks ordinary people, empowers them, anoints them for ministry and set them apart. And so somebody like Peter, somebody like Andrew, the 12 apostles, talk about the 120 men the bible said god just took them and powered them anointed them and they were able to turn their communities they were able to turn the whole nations around so we understood that when the spirit of god descends you remember the brother that we call brother peter he was so you see he was so fearful he was so much of a coward that the bible says that at one time they were going to crucify Jesus. He was following him from behind. And, and, and somewhere, somehow, I don't know how come, uh, the lady got to see this, 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 uh, this gentleman. The Bible says that he confronted him and he told him that, hey, I saw you with the man the other time. And the man denied it with every fiber of his being. He was so much of a coward. He said, let me pass the other side. My man, Father Bika Kray. What Father Bika Kray, no asako siya branche bi. I said, oh, me, who shall we name ne? What tip me and he said, you see, you're near my only yes, na na na. He denied. I don't know anything about Jesus. What's the one son, Father Bika Kray? I just said, where there were dodgy yes, you'll be empty mint, you know. I feel no asako siya branche for fro. I said, me, who now can yes, you? The man denied Jesus. But in Acts chapter 2, when the spirit of god came upon his life uh, he said that for every denial uh, that i deny my jesus uh, i will give him a thousand souls uh, and the bible declares that when this man preached uh, three thousand souls came uh, unto the saving knowledge of jesus uh, that is why i can understand uh, that anybody under the sound of our voice uh, an anointing is coming upon you uh, the spirit of god is coming so much upon you uh, and get ready for the extraordinary in the name of jesus christ uh, if call paul and the others were empowered uh, and they made impact in the communities uh, uh, i came here with an announcement to somebody may the spirit of god uh, may the infilling power of the holy ghost uh, be so much upon your life uh, uh, that you make impact uh, you see i am not talking about only preaching the word uh, but i am talking about your community i am talking about where you work uh, i am talking about your parenting uh, how you are taking care of your case uh, sometimes they say that Ankulana Swedia, listen Ankulana Swedia, what can break the spirit uh, is the holy ghost uh, when the spirit of god descended uh, the bible said paul uh, uh, sorry peter was preaching up uh, and the people cried out what should we do when the spirit of god descended god took men who were ordinary and made the whole world turn upside down I pray that in the name of Jesus, may the Spirit of God, may the power of God, uh, somebody watching us right now, uh, I don't know where you find yourself, but your marriage, uh, you need the Spirit, the power, the hand of God. Uh, and when the Spirit of God descends, I see a turn around. And the last time the prophet Eli also talked about the fact that the fear of the Lord came upon the people. When the mean the Holy Ghost descended, the fear of the Lord, and the Bible said that the apostle worked signs and wonders, miracles. Anytime there is the presence of the Holy Spirit, people fear God. We have got into a dispensation that people don't fear God again. And I know that the prophets say when when when, when the Reverend Stephen Obiamwaku takes it the other time, some other time he's going to talk about the fear of the Lord. But let me just chip in a little. May we get to the point where by the 
the spirit of God come so much upon us that we fear God we have a deal reverence for God in the name of Jesus Christ but listen we pray that in the name of Jesus that is not where we are going today but in the name of Jesus may the fear of the Lord come upon our lives may you get to the point that you know that this is sacred and this is something that is sanctified I can't desecrate something I can't listen go against the will the precept the ordinances of God may that grace come upon our lives Jesus in the name of Jesus today I want us to add one simple thing to it then will be out of your way call somebody we want to share something very little in Acts chapter 3 and verse 1 when the Holy Spirit comes when the Holy Spirit comes what happens when the Holy Spirit descends prophet of God do me the honor and read it for me Acts chapter 3 the verse 1 let's go sir. now Peter and John went up together into the temple at the hour of prayer being the ninth hour praise the lord the bible the, the bible said that uh, peter and john uh, at the hour of prayer they went into the temple to pray in other words when the holy spirit descends he moves us to the place of prayer he moves us to the place of seeking fellowship with god he brings us to the place whereby we want to have a death at with God he moves us to a place whereby we want to hear the counsel of God in the time that the Holy Ghost is in action he brings us to the place that we want to seek fellowship with the Father he brings us to the place whereby we rush into the place of prayer Jesus had taught them anything about prayer but you see when the move of the Spirit is experienced people are moved to the place of prayer and now we can pray a meeting cry and say we can say we eat dinner what the better was sorry for him say yeah yeah dinner and that yeah yeah prayer why huh and go for the mika ever bet dinner no actually prayer no uh so we can say yeah yeah a beer a reality show and was sorry yeah i can you talk about some of them yeah yeah a beer beauty bb and now something uh people want to invest more in that thing than what has to do with the things of god uh it do say yeah what would be none and young to a May we come to the point that the spirit of God moves us to the place that we love the things of God in the name of Jesus. The Bible said, When the spirit, the power of God descended, the people called Peter and John people who were considered refresh people who are considered destitute the spirit of god moved them to the place of prayer to the place of prayer to the place of prayer Oh, can I talk to somebody here? He has spoken to everybody apart from God. He has succeeded in talking about the marriage. The other time, the papa was telling me about something, and and I was so amazed. Was it a little somewhere? And and and, and, and a woman had an issue with a with a husband, and 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 he went with a friend to go and see the man of God to talk about the issue. And so they went to the man of God, and the woman uh, uh, tried to explain what had, uh, what had transpired in the marriage and do you know something the, 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 the friend of the person who had that marital issue just had to hit the woman the victim who had the issue that I don't know whether you are understanding me the person who was an escort tried to tell the person who had the issue what the man that somebody who was an escort in other words he has succeeded in explaining the details
reveals everything that has to do with the peace uh, to the to the, the friend uh, more than God. But in the name of Jesus Christ, uh, may our love for prayer be activated. May our desire for seeking the face of God be activated in the name of Jesus Christ. Uh, may laziness uh, make way for the things of God. Uh, may we come to the place whereby we love to spend time and have fellowship with our maker more than talking to men. Uh, can I talk to somebody here? May God bring us to the place that we want to seek the mind of God by into the mind of God. Uh, in the name of Jesus, may the Holy Ghost descend in your home. May the Spirit of God, somebody is not hearing that what I'm saying. Listen, may God bring you to the place whereby you want to hear from God more than man. More than man. Papa, before we go into, before we continue, let's quickly move to Romans chapter 8 verse 26 and 27 Romans chapter 8 verse 26 come on likewise the spirit also helpeth our infirmity he said the spirit help us in our infirmity we are talking about the Holy Ghost anytime the Holy Ghost comes he help us in our infirmities what does he do for we know not what we should pray for as we ought he said that we don't know how we ought to pray for as we ought but the spirit itself maketh intercession for us. But the spirit itself maketh intercession for us. With groanings which cannot be uttered. With groanings which cannot be uttered. Only for take your time. We'll continue with the 27. Hear me carefully. No man of God can help you navigate into the presence of God. It is the Holy Ghost that can help you navigate and guide you through the place of prayer. That is why sometimes the Bible says we do not we pray amiss because we just pray amiss. We don't know how we ought to pray. But when the Spirit of God takes over, He moves you to the place of prayer. He helps you navigate. He guides you through the prayer and pray the right kind of prayers for impact. He said that we do not know how we ought to pray like we ought to. But the Spirit Himself make an intercession for us somebody under the sound of my voice may the spirit start to intercede for somebody in the name of jesus some things that you ought to pray about that you don't know as we are talking about the holy ghost may the holy ghost begin to intercede for somebody if you can speak in the language of the spirit for one minute i want you to begin to open your mouth in the name of jesus if you can't speak in the language of the spirit just open your mouth and talk to god in the name of jesus in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. to the verse 27 or 4 and he that searcheth the heart knoweth what the mind of the spirit is because he maketh intercession for the saints according to the will of God so if you take your time he said he that what searcheth what the heart the heart knoweth what is in the mind of the spirit he knows what is in the mind of the spirit I don't know whether somebody is getting me you see when, when, when the spirit of God is with you when the Holy Ghost descends upon your life what it does is that it goes to buy into the mind of God and download what God has for you into your life I wish somebody could get that one I said that is something higher for your life you are looking for some lost donkeys but God wants to make you a king and you are looking for something that is mundane but God wants to lift you to a higher dimension may the spirit of God descend so much upon your life and guide you through the path of prayer in the name of Jesus man of God continue and let's go back to our scripture because he maketh intercession for the saints according to the will of God he said that he maketh 
intercession for the saints. Would Dima, a, a friend is say, a, a did it for no, according to what the will of God, according to the will of God, said here, uh, that is why I know that somebody under the sound of my voice, you uh, walk in the will of God, uh, the enemy will not be able to exert upon your life. Uh, the other time I checked in my Bible, uh, he said, The steps of a good man uh, are ordered by the Lord. Uh, I declare, may the spirit of God uh, direct your path uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, maybe you have gone sidetrack, uh, you have gone off track, uh, you have gone against the will, uh, the person, the ordinances of God. Uh, I speak in the name of Jesus. Uh, may the Holy Ghost bring you back on track in the name of Jesus. But if let's go to verse uh, the, Acts chapter 3. Let me Acts add one or two. Three. And verse let, two. Me, let me leave God's people. And a certain man lame from his mother's womb. The Bible said that a certain man lame from his mother's womb. We are in Acts chapter 3. A certain man. They were mentioning names in the Bible. Why is it that they did not mention this guy's name? A certain man. A certain man. Who was lame? Who was lame? They were, they were mentioning people. Deborah and those people. Prophet, your names were mentioned. Stephen was mentioned. Philip was mentioned. But why is it that when they go to this one, they say a certain man? Oh, can I talk to somebody here? Listen, sometimes in the morning we talked about it in an Adum FM. Sometimes your condition can make you have an identity. Your condition can release an identity, an identification because of your downness, because of your weakness, because you are broke, you are deficient in a particular place. You can have an identity. But in the name of Jesus Christ, as the Spirit of God is being preached about, any identity on your life by the seal of the Holy Ghost, we come and let that identity identity be wiped out yes, I said let that identity be wiped out yes, let that identity be wiped out yes, in the name of Jesus I your friend will burn the devil is a liar your friend will say we will hear the devil is a liar may the Holy Ghost Jesus intercede he said that a certain man who was laid from the mother's womb from the mother's womb look at it was carried <laughs> whom they laid daily at the gate of the temple which was called beautiful to Hallelujah. ask alms of them that entered into the temple. Come on, what happened? Who seen Peter and John about to go into the temple asked an alms. Okay. And Peter fastening his eyes upon him with John said, Look unto us. Mm. Verse 5. And he gave heed unto them expecting to receive something of them. In the name of Jesus. Verse 6. Then Peter said, Silver and gold have I none. But such as I have, <laughs> give I unto thee. Yes, Lord. In the name of Jesus name Christ of, Jesus. of Nazareth, Nazareth, rise up and walk. Rise up and walk. And he took him by the right hand. Come on. And lifted him up and immediately, immediately. His, his feet and ankle bones, his feet and ankle bones received strength. Received strength. And he limping up stood up. Come on and walked and Whoa. entered with them into the temple come on he entered with them the man that had been placed uh, at the, you see I, 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 I've, I've kept on thinking about this thing uh, everything is happening uh, inside the temple uh, but the man was relegated uh, at the gate of the temple uh, but when the Holy Spirit descended uh, at the part you see I don't we don't have time to work it uh, but if there is anything to work out uh, the man was lame from his mother's womb uh, in other words he was suffering from something uh, that we call uh, you see it's something that was from the family and some family crisis uh, that he was suffering from uh, but you see the Bible said uh, when the people that were filled with the Holy Ghost got there listen in the name of Jesus Christ uh, any demonic identity Jesus. wherever that you took it from uh, from your Jesus. mother's womb in the name of Jesus uh, oh, as you are listening to us right now uh, yes, I speak for the power of God yes, may the Holy Ghost intercede yes, may the Holy Ghost intervene in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus yes, in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus the Bible said that the man had been placed at the beautiful gate so everybody comes to pass if there is another thing to talk by sometimes demonic stagnation 
everybody is going and coming but you have been stuck at one place for some time but in the name of Jesus Christ Jesus. if there is anything called the Holy Ghost you see the Holy Ghost is a movement the Holy Ghost is not a monument the Holy Ghost is a movement the Holy Ghost is not a monument I command that in the name of Jesus anywhere that your life has been standardized anywhere that your life has been plateaued we command that in the name of Jesus let the effort from the Holy Ghost let the energy from the Holy Ghost move you from the place of obscurity from the place that you have been plateaued for longer I command a movement in the name of Jesus enough of the monument I command a movement in the name of Jesus somebody under the sound of my voice you are being at one place for longer but in the name of Jesus if we are talking about the Holy Ghost at the Bible said how God anointed Jesus Christ of Nazareth with the Holy Ghost and with power who went about in other words he did not stand at one place he was about to God receive that grace for going forward in the name of Jesus. Come on, shout a yes and give him praise. Go forward. When he comes, when he comes, the Bible says that this man that we are talking about, Peter and John got there. He was expecting to receive something. That will be enough to take care of that today that situation now but God wanted something higher he was expecting to get some money from them listen I don't know who I'm talking to if the Holy Ghost that I'm talking about if you are interested you are looking for something little that is why I raised the issue of Saul he was looking for some lost donkeys and that is why we call serendipity. God is saying that I'm looking for a king. And you are standing here looking for lost donkeys. Listen, I prophesy upon some public that is watching us. 200 people here that are watching us. That in the name of Jesus, right from now, anywhere that you are being standardized, I command your movement. I command your movement. I command your movement. In the name of Jesus, you can't stay at one place and declare you are going forward. In the name of Jesus. Jesus. If I want to say something and we want to close. The Bible said that Peter told them look unto us. They were expecting something some money. The man. But look at what happened. He said that silver and gold we don't have. But such as we have what have they received? They had received the Holy Ghost listen he held the man's hand and that ankle bones that were dead that could not walk the bible said that when the holy ghost came the healing power of god descended and the man that could not walk his ankle bones received strength Anytime that the Holy Ghost descends, there is healing. This is where I want to end. Listen right now. Anybody under the sound of our voice, any anomaly in any part of your body, right now in the name of Jesus, place your hand there. And we command that in the name of Jesus, may the hand of God, may the power of God, any time that the spirit of God descends, the healing power of God. Listen, one thing that the Holy Ghost does is that when the Holy Ghost comes, every sickness make way for the health of God. In the name of Jesus Christ, any sickness from the crown of your head to the soles of your feet, we speak to your blood, we speak to your bones, we speak to your body, we speak to your arteries, we speak to your veins, we speak about cardiovascular diseases any kidney disease any liver we command that in the name of jesus christ let the power of the holy ghost descend wherever that you are watching in the name of jesus in the sickness we come out we speak to in the lipids we speak to in the disease in the heart we speak to diabetes we speak to hypertension high blood pressure in the name of jesus we speak to your bones we speak to your spinal cord in the bone we speak your healing now 
in the name of Jesus. 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 Listen, apart from diseases and sickness, there are some people that are sick with the with, 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 with the issue. You see, they are they are sinning, and the sins have become some sickness in their lives. Any iniquity in your life, right now, by the power of the Holy yes, Ghost, Lord. if the man receive his healing, uh, yes, any Lord. addiction, uh, any addiction, yes, any addiction, uh, yes, we speak to anybody under the sound of our voice. Uh, yes, you are addicted. Pornography. We speak to lesbianism. We speak to uh, uh, what are the rest? Help me. Uh, homosexuality. Gayism whatsoever. In the name of Jesus Christ. Uh, you are addicted to drugs. Uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, I made the Holy Ghost. Uh, Hush. In the power of God. Listen. As you are here, I want to end it. But anybody under the sound of our voice, you are going through anything. Right now, in the name of Jesus Christ. Listen, as we are ending, we are not ending. The Holy Ghost is working on your life. You see, from today, any time that you go near that thing, may that thing be poisoned by the Spirit of God. In the name of Jesus, may you have a relapse that will cause you to leave that thing. In the name of Jesus, any demonic depression, anything that you are so addicted to. Jesus, may the power of God descend. May the hand of God descend upon you. Jesus Christ. May the grace of God descend upon you. We speak for the healing power of God. And this series is ending. Every sickness in your body must make way for the power and the health of God. We call it done. We call it established. In the name of Jesus, we are praying. Amen and amen. The Lord bless you. May the grace of God be so much upon your life. May the hand of God be so much upon your life. May you receive. You are good. You are kind. You are bigger than what people say. You are good. You are kind. You are bigger than what people say. That's saying. You are good. You are.